He was abandoned by his parents because of his looks. Years later, he pays them a shocking visit. People say that having a baby is one of the most amazing things in the world, and that the moment you see that tiny being and hold them in your arms for the first time, you'll never love anything else quite as much. But that's not true for everyone, as this one baby found out when he was abandoned by his parents because of his looks. Yasmin Mills was a typical popular girl. She had the coolest new clothes and accessories. She was smart and funny, but the thing that caught people's attention the most was her looks. She was incredibly beautiful, and she knew it as well. Yasmin would constantly use her good looks to get what she wanted, and even though most of the girls were jealous of her during her high school years, most of the boys wanted to date her. Life was relatively easy for the young girl, and it didn't hurt that she came from a rather wealthy background as well. It was during Yasmin's final years of high school, when she was 18 years old, that she met Owen. He was a new student, and he was the epitome of tall, dark, and handsome. Immediately, all of the girls in the school wanted to go out with him, but Owen found himself falling for Yasmin. Luckily for the young man, Yasmin had also developed a crush on him. The two began dating, and before long they were the most popular couple in the school. But then something happened that would change their lives forever. Yasmin became pregnant. The 18-year-old girl was stunned when she found out about her situation. After telling her boyfriend about what she had found out, the young couple were at a loss as to what to do. They both felt that they were too young to have a child, and they still had so much that they wanted to do in life before having to look after a kid. But neither of them wanted to get rid of the child. After taking their time to evaluate all of their options, the young couple decided to keep the baby. The entire pregnancy was incredibly hard for Yasmin. The further along she got, the bigger her belly and other parts of her body became. The young woman hated the fact that she had lost her perfect body, and it had instead been replaced with extra fat and a horrible bloated feeling. As well as that, the pregnancy made her skin break out into awful spots every now and then, which no amount of makeup could hide. But the worst thing of all for the young woman was the constant sick feeling that she had. Despite all of the changes and the unfortunate decisions they had to make in regards to their lives, the couple felt that the one good thing about having the baby would be that it would be incredibly adorable. Both Owen and Yasmin thought that because of their good looks, the baby was sure to inherit all of their best qualities. It was this fact which had the young couple looking forward to being parents, as they would be the perfect, most good-looking family about. Finally, after nine long months, Yasmin went into labor. It took over five hours for the young woman to give birth to her baby, but eventually the ordeal was over. But no one could have expected what would happen next. After giving birth, the baby had been taken away by the nurses to get him cleaned up. Meanwhile, Yasmin and Owen were taken back to the maternity ward to await the reveal of their son. But once the couple laid their eyes on him, they were stunned into silence, and not in a good way. As the nurse handed over the tiny bundle and placed it into Yasmin's arms, the young woman couldn't believe her eyes. This can't be my baby, she said. As Owen caught a glimpse of his son, he also agreed with Yasmin. The baby wasn't how they had expected him to look at all. Instead of angelic and cherub-like cheeks, the baby was quite chubby. His entire face squished in on itself, and his nose was also squished, to a point where Yasmin thought that it kind of looked like a pig's nose. But the thing that horrified the young couple the most was that their baby was covered in hair. All over his body, there was thick, black hair, making the baby look almost like a werewolf. Repulsed at how their baby looked, both Yasmin and Owen thought that there was no way that they could keep him as they didn't want to be seen in public with a baby that looked like that. Together, the couple decided that they would name the child Peter and that they would put him up for adoption. After only a couple of weeks, all of the paperwork had been signed and Peter was officially put up for adoption. With that taken care of, Yasmin and Owen thought that they could finally get on with their lives and build the perfect lifestyle that they felt two beautiful people like them deserved. For the next few months, Peter was passed from foster home to foster home as no one wanted to look after the strangely hairy baby. 
That was until he was taken in by an older woman called Heather Finch and her husband, Gabriel. The couple had always loved children and actually already had two of their own. Unfortunately though, Heather suffered complications when giving birth to her second child, which rendered her unable to conceive any more children. That was why they had decided to foster other, less fortunate kids who needed a good home while waiting to be adopted. Upon the first glance of seeing Peter, both Heather and Gabriel were quite surprised, but as they were looking over him, the young baby looked up at them and smiled a wide, happy smile. It was at that moment that the couple knew what they had to do. Instead of fostering Peter, they immediately asked to adopt him. They loved the child's happy personality and wanted to provide the loving home and family that he deserved. It took a while, but finally the adoption process was complete. Peter was officially a part of their family. As the years went by, Peter grew up like any normal kid. The only difference was that he never lost the strange, thick hair that he had been born with. Even if he shaved his entire body, it would just grow back exactly the same. While he did endure teasing from other children when he was younger, Peter's brothers, Michael and Tom, always made sure to stick up for the boy and put a stop to any bullying. It was when Peter was 18 years old, though, that Heather and Gabriel finally told him the truth about his birth. They told the young man that he was adopted, but they loved him as their own son all the same. Peter was stunned. He couldn't believe it. But even though they weren't his biological parents, the young man still loved them with all of his heart. However, he was curious about who his real parents were. After doing a bit of digging and contacting the adoption agency, Peter eventually found out about Yasmin and Owen. What's more, they lived close by. After discovering this, Peter quickly got into his car and decided to go and pay them a visit. He wanted to know why they had given him up. After driving for roughly an hour, Peter pulled up in front of a rather old and tired house. He got out of his car and knocked on the door, but when it opened, the woman behind it was shocked. Yasmin never thought that she would ever see her son again, and yet there he was, standing right in front of her. But the years had not been kind to the woman. It turned out that after giving Peter up, she had gone to college, but she hadn't done well. Instead of studying, Yasmin had gotten carried away with partying and had flunked out. Angry with her behavior, her father had cut her off from his money, and so the woman was forced to get a job in a nearby shop. The long hours and tiring work hadn't done her any good, and instead of a youthful face and well-looked-after physique, Yasmin had tired eyes and stress wrinkles all over her face. Her body had also suffered, and she was slightly hunched over with clear excess weight. For all of her emphasis on just how important someone's physical appearance was, hers had clearly suffered. With his biological mother in front of him, Peter asked her why she had given him up. It was at this point that the woman sighed. She told him that she couldn't bear the thought of having to raise such a strange-looking child. She feared that everyone would judge her because of how hairy he was. She was the most beautiful girl in the school, and Owen was the most handsome boy, so how could they have ended up with such an ugly baby? It was at this point that Owen appeared behind Yasmin. The man had gained a lot of weight, and his hair had started to thin. As Peter looked the couple over, he realized the irony of what they had done. They thought that by giving him up, they would go on to lead extravagant and luxurious lives simply because of their good looks. Instead, they had ended up with dead-end jobs and deteriorating health. It was at this point that Peter did something truly shocking. He thanked Yasmin and Owen for giving him up for adoption. Because of their decision, the young man had grown up with an incredibly loving family and even had brothers to spend his time with. More than that, they all loved him no matter what he looked like. He was able to learn important life lessons from them because of this, that it didn't matter what a person looks like, it's their personality that's the important thing, something he likely wouldn't have learned had he stayed with his biological parents. After telling the couple this, Peter turned around with a big smile on his face and left to go back home to the family that loved him no matter how much hair he had or how he looked. What an incredible story. How would you have reacted in Peter's situation? 
Let me know in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more amazing stories.